So I've had quite a few comments about crawl control. Now in case you don't know what crawl control is, crawl control is a specialized computerized system that some Toyotas have. I think the Tacoma has it. We don't have too many of them here in Australia. And I think the Land Cruiser 200 series might have it. I don't really know because I've never actually seen it work in the flesh. I have seen a lot of videos about it though. And uh, in some situations, sure it does seem to work, but in sand, I don't know. But anyway, a lot of my viewers, or a few of them at least, have commented on a different video that I've made saying, if you just spin the tires very, very slowly, similar thing to what crawl control does, you should be able to just gently crawl out of the situation, even if you're bogged down like we are here. So I've purposely got the car stuck, and I want to try this crawl control thing out, spinning the tires super, super slowly, seeing if I can actually crawl out of the situation. So uh, without any further ado, Let's see if we can get out of this before morning tea. Okay guys, so I'm gonna put it into low range and I'm gonna engage the diff lock as well to give it every chance it's got. Once it decides to kick in, there we go. All right, so uh, I guess now we just start spinning the tires and see what happens. You know what, even though it doesn't look like we're moving, I think we are actually moving very, very slowly. <laughs> we're bouncing, but we are moving. Far out, there actually could be something to this myth. So uh, just before I shot this video, I actually did a video where I also got stuck and it took me four and a half minutes to dig the car out. So uh, I'll be very curious how long this actually takes if we actually eventually manage to get ourselves out. We're actually making some progress. We've come forward about, I'd say a meter. I was not expecting that to work. I was so, so skeptical about that. I'm gonna to have to eat my words now. But anyway, you spend your whole life learning and today we've learned something. If you're bogged on the beach, you might be able to crawl out of the situation. Now, it really depends what sort of vehicle you have as well. This vehicle has a diff lock. If you were doing it in a four wheel drive that had open diffs, you'd probably just have the two opposite tires spinning and you probably wouldn't actually get anywhere because all the drive would just go to those tires. Now, also this is an automatic in a manual vehicle. It probably would be a little bit more difficult, not completely unachievable, but just more difficult. But hey, if you've got an automatic vehicle and you've got a diff lock or a really good LSD, you might actually be able to use this recovery technique. Now, you might be wondering, what are my tires at? My tires are at 20 PSI. I had to air them up from 10 PSI because I just couldn't get stuck to make this video otherwise. But hey, on 20 PSI, we managed to crawl ourselves out. So there you go, guys. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, yeah, we're always learning, eh? So don't forget to get out there and learn. And seek adventure. I was so, so skeptical about that.